Good morning, family. This is Marvin, one third of the family. Oh, just bringing you guys uh, a quick breakfast uh, that's 100% plant based that you can give a go. Uh, typically, in our mornings, we have oatmeal, but um, and then sometimes we might jazz it up and you know put some scrambled tofu, whatever Amber's uh, feeling like putting together. All I do is just eat. So, anyways, uh, this is a sample breakfast here that's very easy. I think the total cost is about two dollars total. Um, this is just your regular 100% uh, whole wheat bread. We want to stress that if you're looking to cut back uh, your um, consumption of dairy and things of that nature, you want to look for 100% whole wheat bread. Check the label. It'll tell you if it contains any milk uh, byproducts. So whole wheat bread here with some basic uh, almond butter. We got this from Aldi. Uh, you know, super cheap. You can do peanut butter if you'd like then an avocado with black pepper. Now, um, the cool thing about avocado, especially when it's as ripe and soft as it is here, is that it tastes just like boiled egg, especially when you put that salt and pepper on it. I'm sorry, not salt, uh, just black pepper. Um, it tastes just like a boiled egg. We would have boiled eggs all the time when we were um, not vegans, and this taste, your brain will not know the difference, especially with that black pepper on it. And then, of course, uh, just a regular old banana. We eat a lot of bananas in this house. And, um, you know, there's numerous benefits to bananas, of course. Uh, high in energy, you know, potassium, all that jazz. Now, this is um, yogurt here. And as vegans, we enjoy yogurt. You know, we just enjoy dairy-free yogurt. So this is the Silk brand. Um, not really a big fan of the Silk brand, but I believe this was on sale. So I think that's why Babe got this. But typically, we'll get so delicious brand of um, yogurt and it's made with uh, coconut milk and you can find that at uh, Sprouts I believe uh, as well as Kroger's as well and then we topped it with some grain free maple almond granola I believe we found this at Sprouts but any kind of granola to your tasting just be sure to check the sugar this has four grams of sugar per serving six grams of protein so Another byproduct for my brothers out there that's um, trying to stay fit and healthy and all that, that this is a lot of protein uh, in, this, in this meal, even though there's no meat whatsoever, and there's a lot of protein in here. So, um, brothers and sisters, everybody is working out. I'm sorry. So, hopefully you guys are enjoying your home workouts. We are as well. So, um, we're going to try to do more of these where we just show you what we put together in our household for a quick breakfast here uh, that everyone can enjoy before you start your work day, uh, work from home day. Hope y'all are staying blessed. Talk to you soon. We got our jam session coming tonight on YouTube and IG Live at uh, 7.30 p.m. Eastern. All right, guys. Peace.